I would say first of all is uh, my family. Um, I was quite uh, privileged enough to come from a family that uh, took education very seriously. Um, my parents were, you know, both well educated up to up to uh, tertiary level. Uh, my dad was a professional uh, chartered accountant, uh, so I think that kind of rubbed off on on me. And also, I had about five other siblings who were equally highly motivated. Uh, to do well academically so it's a bit of sort of internal rivalry within the family which i think is always good uh, so i think that really drove me to want to um you know make my family feel proud and make my dad believe that you know i had some sense of direction um but i think that's something that's very important if you come from an african family so um yeah so i had to sort of live up to that expectation and that really drove me to want to um, study at, um, at a higher level i think i think for me it was a no-brainer um because I remember coming from Nigeria to London and um, being sort of blown away by, you know, the, the vibrant nature of London as a city. Um, you know, I was really attracted to that uh, and I wanted to stay in London um, uh, to, to sort of further my experience from a social and a learning um, standpoint because there was so much opportunity around in London. Um, so that was a big drive uh, for wanting to study in London and I think SOAS just came natural you know, along with that sort of uh, um, uh, view, um, because I remember when I was at college, um, the first thing I, I was asking myself was, where can I get the best experience socially, culturally and academically? And I think uh, SOAS came to mind, you know, SOAS is very unique. Uh, it's multicultural, it's, you know, has a high, high reputation for academic excellence, academic brilliance. Um, so that really sort of got me really interested in SOAS. So I came in uh, for an open day um, and then I got to speak with some of the lecturers. I got to speak with some of the um, current students about, you know, their experiences at SOAS. And I think the experience, the, the information I got was very, very uh, positive. Um, I felt really encouraged. Everyone sort of takes interest in you at a very primary level. So that prompted me to do a pre-summer school program. So basically, if you're the first in your family to go to university, uh, you get the opportunity to sort of partake in this uh, summer school where, you know, SOAS uh, students and SOAS lecturers will get to put you through uh, what to expect, you know, at university. Although it didn't really match uh, my criteria because obviously my parents had gone to uni, but I still wanted to take advantage of that opportunity because it was being offered to everybody who was interested in SOAS anyway. So I took part in that and that really sort of opened my mind into what to expect at SOAS and I never looked back after that. I would say it's probably one of the best experiences I've had up to this point. Uh, to be honest, uh, because I met some of the, you know, I met some of the best guys who today are still my very good friends. Um, we sort of keep motivating each other. Even now in my current profession, uh, some of them are doing very well and they keep pushing me forward. We sort of, you know, um, are pretty much friends for life um, as a result of our uh, experience at SOAS. So SOAS gave me the opportunity to meet these people. Um, I also had the opportunity to become even more aware of international studies. Uh, so in my law program, I studied interesting um, subjects like uh, legal systems of Asia and Africa, law and society in uh, South Asia. I, I learned about Hindu law for the first time. I learned about Islamic law for the first time. I learned about Islamic finance. You know, so for me, it was a, an amazing experience. Uh, really got me thinking at a global level. Um, and, and for me, that was, uh, I would say, that was very important in sort of giving me a, a grounder into my career, uh, which is what I'm doing now, uh, working at a corporate law firm, acting for international clients. Okay, so now I, I'm, I'm a corporate finance lawyer uh, at an international law firm called Robes and Gray. Um, so I started working there just two and a half years ago. Um, and I think SOAS was a big stepping stone in me getting to this uh, career because um, First of all, as I said earlier, SOAS gave me a good exposure to international law, um, not just to international law, but to you know, a good understanding on how different legal systems across the world sort of interact. Um, and you get to appreciate how um, all these interactions you know, at a global level impacts on your personal life individually, uh, regardless of where you are in the world. Uh, more so you know, for businesses as well, because I think these days most deals are done at the transactional level. So if you understand, for example, how to do business in Nigeria, or you understand how to uh, to, to negotiate a complex uh, finance with uh, 
uh, a fund in Saudi Arabia or in the Middle East, you know, taking account of Islamic law, Islamic financing, you know, I think you're pretty much the go-to guy. So I think so has really helped me sort of build those knowledge, which was very important, and also helped me, you know, push for my education even further by going to Oxford. Uh, I think it was a massive sort of opportunity for me. Um, be very proactive. Um, try to speak to people. Um, you know, to your make use of your college facilities. Speak to your careers advisors. Um, I'm sure you know most people would know about SOAS because SOAS is well well known in the academic space. Uh, speak to them about SOAS. Come down to SOAS and you know speak to some lecturers here as well. Speak to students. Um, I, I guess the good thing with SOAS is everybody's friendly. Everybody's approachable. So, you know, it's just a matter of dropping an email to someone and say, oh, can I come around and have a feel for, you know, what to expect here. Um, also make use of the summer school programs um, because that really worked for me. And I, and I think, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a good opportunity, you know, to get the first-hand experience of life at SOAS.